we're on Kingston Bridge at the moment. We're gonna go to Home Park, which is over there, behind those trees. But you get a nice view, nice view of the River Thames. There's always uh, quite a lot of swans here. It's a nice place for them. Quite an old bridge as well. I don't know if this is like a newer one, but uh, there has been a bridge here for quite some time. Now uh, we're gonna go to the park and see some baby animals, hopefully. So here's a map of the park. So here is Kingston Bridge. This is uh, Home Park and it is uh, basically the gardens of uh, Hampton Court Palace, which is a nice, uh, nice palace around here. Uh, we'll go into the, a little bit of history in there as well. It won't be a proper video, but it, it will be like a vlog style video. We'll see hopefully some little animals over here. We saw them last week when we were on a walk here. So uh, hopefully some baby deer, some baby like goslings maybe, and uh, baby swans. And I will go all the way over here to have a look at the back of uh, Hampton Court Palace. That's facts. Oh, hmm. Here we go, a depiction. Which is funny because this is uh, Henry VIII, but this is the back part of the palace, which was uh, only built in like the 1600s. Uh, Henry VIII, of course, is uh, like 1500s. So. I guess it kind of mix, mix, um, matched uh, some aspects of history there because uh, Hampton Court is a mix mash of uh, two styles of history. When it was um, Henry VIII's palace, but then uh, the backside is actually uh, renovated, completely different, made by uh, one of the Stuart kings. So we'll have a look at uh, the backside in a, later on in the video. This is Hampton Wick Pond. Oh, there it has. It has a sign on here. This is where we saw some baby swans and uh, goslings and, and little moorhens as well. There was a little nest there the other day. Yeah, you've got these uh, big fields, like grass fields as well, where, with a lot of deer, which we will uh, no doubt have a look at later as well. We've got some babies over here. I suppose we shouldn't get too close. You can see them, hopefully. Oh, they're going away. <laughs> Just a little. I guess these are like the... It's like the season of the babies. I don't know if I can... Uh, yeah. Yeah, hopefully, I'm, I'm recording this on a GoPro, so hopefully uh, I can zoom in. To the little babies. There's another baby goose there but it's, it's like growing up already. It's, a, it's got a little bit of down feather still but it's kind of shedding it over there. Over there in the distance you've got some uh, swans as well with some smaller swans. Well one big swan with some uh, some smaller ones. So we're coming up on the the main avenue here that uh, goes to Hampton Court Palace, which is over there in the distance. It might be a little too far to see right now, but we'll get closer as well. Also, this uh, is an area where, th where the deer have their babies, so you might see some of those as well. If you don't see some right now, we, we got some footage of uh, last time we were here. We saw some deer, so I'll show that on screen if you don't see any right now. I can't see any herds yet. Have you seen any herds? Did you? Yeah. No. They usually like there's tons of them in the grass and they move move in herds. They it's do move. 150 in acres herds. here, so they could really be anywhere. It's a bird box as well for birds. Also, these trees they give off a lot of pollen. I don't know. Does anyone know which trees they are? Big I don't trees. know. Big trees. Yes. Yes, big trees. I, I remember in school we learned like by looking at the leaves, like what kind of tree it was, but the I don't green, remember. Green leaves. Big and uh, white flower things. Yellowish? No, not, but yeah, yellowish. Well, we're getting closer to the palace in the distance. Still no deer though. Yeah. I think we found a herd in the distance. We'll get a little closer, but they're resting now. So it looks like they're all having a rest over there now. 
Last time we were here, yeah, it is hot. 28 degrees. 28. Yeah. Last time we were here, we came here a little bit earlier in the day, so they were still grazing, but I guess they, they have their afternoon nap now. I can see a little stack there, but most of them don't have the antlers, so... Oh, that one's moving. Didn't see any babies there. And we'll continue to look for them. I don't know if you can see it, but there's like a lot of pollen in the air, especially when the wind blows. We're close to the palace now as well. We're coming up to the gates over here. This is the back side of Hamden Court Palace. We'll be able to look inside the gardens as well. Not go inside though. Uh, but yeah, this is the back side. This is the steward part of the palace. Oh, all that pollen. I don't know if you can see it, but... Uh, yeah, so this is the steward part of the palace. This was uh, renovated later, because the front side is the Tudor part of the palace, which was uh, Henry VIII's palace. It used to be like all Tudor, but then uh, I think... I think it was James I. I'm not sure which steward monarch started to renovate it. His plan was to renovate the whole thing actually, but uh, he ran out of money and uh, then it only ended up uh, being enough uh, for the backside to be renovated. So I don't know if you, you might be able to get a back, better view from uh, over there. But yeah, he didn't have enough money. So that's why uh, the backside is the Stuart Palace, uh, like the 1600s and the front side is still the original uh, Tudor palace uh, so the early 1500s there's some more deer in the distance over there here you can maybe see a better view of the gardens got a fountain which is nice i think this is like the the long water it's called it's a long stretch of water you can kind of see it but not really long water last time we were here we went through this thing which is filled up with pollen and like little tree branches no oh yeah there's a little deer in the distance we won't go there this time but last time we went there and they were like we got really close to the deer and we had to wait for them to cross the little walkway where do we see uh, in the shade under there. Yeah, oh yeah, they're laying there, yeah. Because it's too hot. Oh, and there's a jogger running towards them. Oh, what time is it? I don't know. Must be six o'clock then. Maybe, uh, they're, they're doing the little uh, clock at Hampton Court. Looks like they listen to the clock and it's time to eat again. Like those got up over there, those deer. Then in front of us, there's, they started grazing again. I think they're the ones that uh, that we came across uh, on the way over and started grazing. We don't want to get too close because we don't want to scare them. We were meant to stay 50 meters away from them at all times, but it's not really possible. They have legs and they can run to you. Gotta be careful where you step here too. Poo poo, poo poo poo. There's poo poo everywhere. Yeah. Look at the feather Lucia. This is a nice feather. So nice and eat it. I don't know. I was thought I shouldn't pick up animal feathers. Because they could have germs. I guess the, look, they, they see us coming so they're going to the long grass. There's none of my subscribers. What? Fan the meetup. Fan meetup, oh yes. Here. <laughs> Have you seen any babies? I haven't seen. Oh, there is one. There is one. I don't know. There is one. Yeah. I guess we'll see some babies. Well, they've got anyway. a bunch of babies as well from last time. Yeah. There's I think there might baby. be. There's a baby. Oh, I stood up. Oh. Looks like that one is like the guard, and that's the herd. Here's a little sword. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I don't know, do you see any males? Do you see any stags? There was one in the other group. Oh, there's one that has little horns. Oh, yeah. 
I know that at one point in at one point they lose their horns and then they have to regrow them again so maybe that's what happens. They're making that noise again. Oh the little, little, little baby stopped to look at us. Baby why are you so obsessed with me? Baby I'm taken. <laughs> oh I think are we gonna wait for them to go? Yeah. Oh yeah, they're all going. That's nice with the wind. You have wind? Don't tell them that. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, that's all of them going to eat again now. A lot of crickets as well in the grass. I don't know if you can hear them. But not for my jokes, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. Thank you. I think it's pretty crazy that if they just turned on us, they could easily kill us. But I don't think they're smart enough to work together. Uh, like maybe, maybe the... You know that's what they always say in those films and then 10 seconds later they're all dead. Yeah. Because they're there's just some... animals, they're not smart enough. And then they'll eat some radiated grass and they'll become super deer. Yeah, and you think their little poop noise is just them making poop noises? Mm-mm. They're saying kill them. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if you heard it earlier, but they made a noise. Yeah, that noise. There's a little ladybug here. Be careful, you're going to bite you. Yeah. One landed on my leg the other time. And now his leg is gone. No, it's still here. I showed them. I got, I got two of them. It's only impressive if you have three. I imagine some people have three. Not fully formed legs. No, I guess not fully formed. Maybe like no. a little stump when they like ate the twin in the wall. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. A, fl a fly went right in my ear. You're gonna have to censor that for YouTube. Maybe yeah. a spit your exclusive. Oh, fuck, I'm getting attacked by a fly. <laughs> actually, oh. <laughs> fuck, they're actually following us. <laughs> I think we got them. <laughs> But they were actually following us. Yeah, they were flying around your head like crazy. Maybe it's just sun cream. Oh, maybe. We went from big animals to small ones. There's a caterpillar here. I wonder what type. I don't know. It's meant, to, it's meant to go in the trees. Don't touch it though. I shouldn't touch it. It's covered in loads of big black spikes. spikes. So maybe it's got poison on it. It's gonna eat you. No. Maybe it fell out of the tree. It's like Don't the size of a little kept. finger, so it's yeah. pretty big. I don't know if it comes off big enough on camera. Yeah. But well, they grow a lot. Yeah, I, I had butterflies. I got them as little caterpillars. I got it from the natural fish. No, the science museum. So you send off, and they send you a little tub with the little caterpillars in. I buy. Oh! Okay. Wait, we have another one. I didn't Christ. want to step on it, it scared me. It's a bumblebee. What are, what are all these insects doing on the ground, eh? It's probably because it's so hot, they're just tired. Oh, okay. Luckily this one can't sting me, right? Bumblebees don't sting, right? No, I'm pretty sure they do sting. What? Well, they're meant know. to be the They're meant to be the nice bees. It's because they're cute and fat, like me. <laughs> okay. Uh, goodbye. Oh, look, it has some pollen on it. Pollinating the trees. He's pollinating the grass. Okay. Okay, I, I guess we'll let's go before they like fly in me. In you? Yeah, in my ear like the <laughs> like the flies. Yeah, there were like fifteen flies around your hat. Yeah, I just I just felt like a little bzz in my ear, and I was like, ah. and then I looked behind me, and there was like a swarm of them. And they had knives. <laughs> yeah, there's quite a few butterflies as well in the in the grass. Yeah, well, one we, thing I don't get is why there's not more rabbits here, or squirrels. Yeah, I think, yeah, we don't really see quirl, squirrels or rabbits in this park, but it might be because it's too crossy. Yeah, maybe these trees don't have acorns on, so what are the squirrels going to eat? Oh, right, yeah. But... Yeah, I, I suppose mean, that might be the case. There's probably foxes that will come out at night, because of all the human mm. like, rubbish. Well, there's foxes on the streets. They walk through Kingston, like... Hello. 
And then they eat their trash. They're like Kobe that way. What? Walking through the streets of Kingston and eating trash. You can actually see, I don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera, but over there you can see like the tip of the church. Just the tip. In like yeah, central Kingston. Little view back. It actually became more cooler now. I guess it's like starting to get like uh, when it's not darker. Bright. Yeah. It's a bit cloudy. Yeah, it's a good temperature now. We've got some butterflies over here. I don't know if you can see the. Oh, another fly went to my eye. Oh, they're, they're actually staying still, these. Oh, look, a badger with a knife. Is it the badger? Is, is this a badger's hole? Well, that's what these mounds of earth are everywhere are. Okay. It was so on the information sheet at the beginning. Oh, okay. I guess I should read them. So I guess there should be some smaller animals that the badgers eat. Like they the eat badgers children. eat... Do the, the badgers eat squirrels or rabbits? I think they're omnivores, no, are right? Crazy. I think they eat whatever. And then they get rabies and they bite people and then people turn into zombies and then... So that's a dog. I Where's saw a dog in the grass by the pond. Maybe it was just a baby deer. Oh man. Oh they got a little frisbee playing with the dog. I guess there are quite a lot of these mounds. Yeah, they, it was saying I think it said William the Third. Oh he did some stuff here too. He was riding his horse and he his horse tripped up on one of the badger mounds and then he died. The horse or William? He did. Oh, he did. Oh. I'll have to double check that and if it's wrong and you put this in the video, put a little like asterisk with who it actually was. But yeah. I'm pretty sure it said William. Yeah, like he, also when the horse fell over, he fell over too and got injured and then died in Kensington Palace. Oh, so he did make it like to London. Well, I mean, it's not hard to get to because the River Thames from here, which is the next Hampton Court Palace, goes all the way up into central London. Oh, yeah, I guess you can make a get a little boat. And that'd be faster than, and more comfortable than riding a horse, or being in a carriage, mm -hmm. or being carried by some puppies with little pillows on their back. I don't know. <laughs> what do rich people do? I guess that's what they might do. The last one? Yeah, the last one. Oh yeah. Well, actually, oh no, because the puppies can't handle the weight but there's a little baby moorhen in the water making the noise baby swans baby swans over there again look at the guy because I'm me same sound Kobe makes when he hasn't had salami in 20 minutes mm. it's coming this way look at it go and the like mother or father got like a twig or something in the mat. I don't know if you can see it. Oh look, this, this one is chasing a duck. Over there mm -hmm. to the left. Over there. Oh. <laughs> you see him? Yeah. He <laughs> probably said his wife is a hoe. Oh look, there's this one with the babies. Yeah, they're gonna fight over there. Punch him in the face! <laughs> what happened there? Ju he's just chasing the geese. <laughs> I, thought, I thought the geese were meant to be the aggressive birds. So that's it for the video over here, next to the little pond with all the wildlife happening. Oh, he's gonna... oh yeah, the goose is, uh, the swan is still chasing the goose over there behind the tree. Uh, we've got the big wall enclosing the park over here as well. And uh, yeah, oh, there's a little dog there as well. 
I wonder what's gonna happen when they go to the. Swans are pretty aggressive. Yeah, I guess they're they're, they're waiting until the the birds are uh, done fighting behind the tree. Can't really see it right now. But yeah, thank you for watching. A special thanks to my patrons and especially uh, Parker Dai, who has uh, become my first Duke tier patron. Let me know what you thought about this uh, like kind of casual video walk through home park in the comments. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. You I love his mom. <laughs>